Through membership or involvement in CPNP student chapters, student membership in CPNP provides opportunities to explore the profession, attend the annual meeting, network, and participate in national committee activities. This is going to be our second year in existence, and uh, so far, first year has been very uh, fruitful. We've made a lot of connections with a lot of uh, organizations that deal with mental health. Um, we're getting involved with NAMI. We recently just got involved with the Maryland Coalition of Families, and so we're going to be, you know, extending our roots with them uh, in order to, you know, gain better connections, learn what they do in, you know, the mental health field, and see how we can contribute to that. Over the next year, Howard University student chapter of CPMP will uh, mostly spend our time drawing more attention from the student body. Uh, one of the things that we're going to do is a NAMI walk. We're going to have the NAMI walk with University of Maryland. Students are making decisions about where they want to do, um, what they want to get more involved with, and that's how they're going to rank rotations and. If you're going to pursue a residency and say that your interest is psychiatry, you need to show that you have furthered your interest either through this organization or getting involved with professors who specialize in psychiatry. It will impact my career in probably many ways. Just being part of this organization and starting a new organization, for, um, I've learned so much about psychiatric pharmacy. I've been involved with the faculty and also I learned from my fellow students because we didn't know that we had so many shared interests in our careers and we were able to find ways that we can grow in this profession even as a student rather than just when we go out there and meet faculty and meet uh, people in the workforce. We're already meeting students and networking within our school as well. Another thing that we are planning about to do is to set up a mentorship program. Uh, we are thinking about uh, inviting a psychiatric pharmacist to come in and actually uh, providing a mentoring uh, uh, program for our students so that they have a better understanding of what uh, psychiatric pharmacists really do on a clinical uh, setting. I really hope that it'll provide me with lots of examples of how to really empathize with different types of people and provide me lots of examples of role models and how to be a better pharmacist in the future. There are a lot of benefits to the annual meeting. For me, I uh, joined one of our committees, which is a student standing committee, and coming to the meeting gave me a chance to then interact with everybody at the meeting, which has been great. It's been an opportunity to meet everyone. Also at the meeting, just in talking to people, I recognize there are so many different venues for psychiatric pharmacy, uh, from you know an independent pharmacy uh, to a state hospital. So that's been uh, really interesting. Uh, students can benefit from attending an annual meeting. Uh, first and foremost, the networking is huge. It's just like anybody, everyone has said, it's a small community of um, uh, CPM peers. So we are able to put the name to the face and face to the name. And uh, once we do go out to seek residencies, they will remember us. Student membership in CPNP can be a valuable contributor to a pharmacy student's educational growth and career prospects, offering a wealth of resources, experiences, and contacts. Formation and involvement in local student chapters further enhances these experiences and allows students to contribute to their local mental health communities, their university and student body, and CPNP National. If you are interested in more information about student membership, membership benefits, and student chapter formation, please visit the Student Hub on the CPNP website located under the Members tab.